A $4 million renovation is becoming more and more realistic for Delphi. The stellar community will be getting a brand new community center in hopes of driving economic development. News 18's Brittany Tyner joins us now. Brittany, how is the progress coming with Delphi's historic opera house? Dan, funds are coming through and contractors could be hired as soon as next month. You may remember this spring Delphi won grant money to beautify and preserve historic areas and buildings. Now, the dream is getting closer and closer to becoming a reality. It's a building that dates back to 1865. The first event was a dance for soldiers returning home from the Civil War. But now, the Opera House in Delphi is getting a $4 million facelift and will open as a community center. Anything from uh, uh, certainly musical performances to theatrical performances, weddings, wedding receptions, all of those events will draw hundreds of people into the community. Opera House Advisory Board Chair Anita Whirling says preservation of the Opera House is one of the biggest projects underway in the stellar community. She says the Delphi Preservation Society will work with the city to come up with the funds to match the stellar community grant. Two and a half million of that comes from the stellar funding through the state and then a million and a half will be raised uh, by the Delphi Preservation Society as the match for that. An informational work session was held for the Delphi City Council Thursday night. Mayor Randy Strasser says the council will have to approve the agreement between the Preservation Society and the city to fund the project. He says the investment now will save money in the long run. To not only bring stability and business and jobs into the downtown area, but it increases our assessed value uh, in the community too. And, and when we increase that assessed value, our, that, that gets our tax rates down too. Strasser says over the past four years, he and the city council have been working hard to make sure the city is financially stable. Because of that, he says the dollars are available for this big investment. Anita Whirling says the Opera House is slated to open early in 2015. She says planning for other stellar projects like revitalizing downtown building facades and revamping sewer systems are also well underway. Brittany Tyner, News 18. Brittany, thanks. Some good news there. The exact dollar figure of improvement is not known, but the initial announcement in May pledged 15 to 20 million dollars in the next three years from state and federal funds, along with matching grant money.